my beautiful people you're welcome back to my youtube channel so if you're new to this channel do remember to thumbs up and subscribe to this channel because you are going to be seeing some interesting exciting you know natural tips and remedy that would help you but in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to turn dark lips to pink lip using natural and home remedies those things are the things you can actually find in your kitchen at the comfort of your home and they are very effective and very very safe so if you're new to this channel you are highly welcome do thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel and also share this video and if you want to know what comprises of my natural home remedy for pink lips please do continue watching and follow me on instagram guys if you want to drop any question please do that on my website the link will be somewhere at my description box and also at my comment section all right guys let's run into this video all right guys so the very first ingredients we're going to be needing for this um dark lip remedy would be petroleum jelly which is vaseline Alright, so we're going to be using Vaseline in mixing with all other natural remedy to give us a pink and um, soft lips. Vaseline helps to retain moisture onto the skin and using it on the lip would the lip soften and more um, pink, okay? So the next ingredient we're going to be needing will be honey. So this is my organic honey honey in this bowl all right so honey is a skin saving property it helps to treat acne honey is naturally antibacterial in nature so it is it is great for the skin and it prevents aging it also prevents um cracked lips and dry lips it helps the lips soften and also it gets it to pink color all right so using honey will be great in slowing down the aging process on the skin as well as boosting the moisture on the lip and it helps to create a glow and softness on the lip okay so the next ingredients we're gonna be needing will be brown sugar now in this um pink lip remedy you have to use brown sugar okay so it can work really really well brown sugar has smaller particles it is more gentle and safer on the skin it's also used for an exfoliating um property and it's also perfect for sensitive skin so whatever skin tone or skin color or skin texture you have you can use brown sugar okay it regulates the skin and it's also good for a strong and hard skin all right so using brown sugar for the skin will help to scrub out dead skin cells and to make your skin look healthy glowing and soft and also pinkish okay so that's why we're gonna be needing that and the last ingredient we're gonna be needing will be toothpaste of course we use toothpaste to brush our teeth but toothpaste is good in uh, removing um, dark spots and it's perfect also for pimples and pigmentations okay so we're gonna be using toothpaste alongside with all other natural remedy for this dark lips okay turning pink so now let's prepare all our ingredients together we're taking okay it's actually very hard opening this um vaseline i'll be needing just a little pinch of the vaseline all right i actually don't need too much of that though so i'm going to be Scooping that out into the bowl. Then I'll be turning in the lemon, I'm sorry, the honey into this. And yeah, guys, I'm just going to be needing this a little. Just a little quantity will go a long way. And also for the brown sugar, we're going to be needing about half a tablespoon of the brown sugar. 
that is going to help us in scrubbing and exfoliating the lip and to help us even more scrub I'm going to be pouring in or pressing in the toothpaste now after that is done I'm going to be mashing and mixing all the ingredients together to give me a fine paste okay and you have to mix and mix well because when mixing brown sugar it's going to be looking um, somewhat draw like slimy okay like this that is all great okay and yeah because I've been scrubbing my lip really really well okay so now I'm gonna be putting in the treatment and now I'm gonna be scrubbing okay so I'm just gonna keep my lip together so it doesn't get into my mouth but of course if you get into your mouth all of the things here are edible and very natural so there is no side effect whatsoever so what I'm gonna do is to scrub mm -hmm. so you have to scrub this for about um, one minute like 60 seconds you have to be patient and scrub it okay so you put more so that you have more of the treatment to work with okay so you do it this way scrub it in a circular motion scrub all right so now you can actually just clap your lip together like this and you scrub also <laughs> now you have to scrub this side okay because for some people your um around the lip actually is to look darker okay so you don't want to experience that so you have to scrub this side and this side also with it and you are good to go like trust me all right so after you scrub this you you have to leave it on for a couple of minutes for like one more minute you're gonna be feeling that um this is just going to you know hold um kind of make your lip feel softer and all of that like it feels really good on my lip right now okay so i'm gonna be holding it for about one more minute and i'm gonna go wash this off and i'll be right back okay, so you can actually store this treatment for two to three days or to four days even if you want you can scrub it every day but you shouldn't scrub too hard just like I earlier said okay so that you won't have to bruise your skin don't scrub too hard just scrub very very gentle and very mild and you are good to go so basically guys that's just a very simple way to scrub out the dead skin cells on your lip all right that is actually making your lip look dry chappy and very dark well there's nothing wrong with it being dark but when it's looking very very unhealthy you have to scrub out um the dead skin cells out of there so if you did enjoy watching this video please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up subscribe to my youtube channel and share this video also turn on the bell right beside the subscribe buttons that way you will be notified when i upload a new video if you want to ask me any questions please do drop them on my website the link will be at my description box and also at my comment section all right beautiful ladies and gentlemen i will see you soon in my next video stay flawless bye guys Mwah.